Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a really quick and easy one balloon pig using just one 260 modelling balloon. Inflate your balloon to a tail of about five to six fingers. Give it a squeeze to make sure it's nice and soft. And then take your uh, index finger and push the nozzle and knot into the balloon, okay? And then at about this point here, you should just be able to see your balloon, your, your finger, sorry, through the balloon. And grab, squish your balloon and grab hold of that knot and nozzle and then remove your finger, okay? Keep hold of the knot and nozzle and this side of the knot twist, okay? When you've twisted quite a few times, you can let go, okay? And if you want to, you can just push this side of the balloon up a little bit and that's going to hold in place. We're going to make a very small loop, okay, of just a couple of fingers. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take hold with these two fingers of that knot and nozzle that I've just trapped in that little twist. I'm going to bend the balloon over, make a very small loop and twist that not a nozzle into that little loop I've made, okay? And that loop is so small, it's virtually a pinch twist, okay? So just soften your balloon again and make another very small loop that is very soft. Bend it over and twist. Okay, so that's what you've got. Give your balloon a bit of a squeeze and twist off a two finger bubble. Okay. Next, make a bubble of about two inches. Hold on to this small bubble here and the end of your balloon because if you don't, the bubbles will unravel at this point. Just squeeze your balloon to make it a little bit soft and twist another bubble to match this one, okay? And then wrap this section into this section here. So fold the balloons over, the bubbles over, and just twist them round, okay? So that's what you've got. I want to make a small body of maybe four fingers. And then I want to make two more legs to match these two, okay? So twist off another bubble and again we're holding on to this first bubble and the end and then make another bubble to match this one so fold the balloon over twist off that bubble and then wrap the two together next I'm going to twist off a small bubble okay and I'm going to pinch twist this so I'm going to bend the balloons over, the bubbles over. I'm going to grasp hold of this bubble here, pull it upwards, and as I do so, twist it round. Okay, so that's kind of in one motion. Twist it round a few times. I don't need the rest of the balloon so I can break it off or cut it off. And with the excess, just tie a knot. So there's your really quick and easy one balloon pig. I'll see you again in the next video.